welcome to part two on how to make a hedgehog body parts out of modeling clay. If you've missed my first video on how to make the pom-pom hedgehogs, I will link it up above. If you've never worked with modeling clay before, just keep in mind you have to work with it somewhat fast because it does dry out. So first off, I'm going to show you how to make ears. Using two same sizes of clay, pinch one between your fingers and mold around your thumb. Do the same to the second ear. Next, we'll be creating the paws. Again, separate two equal parts. To begin making the paw, pinch a section into your fingers so you have something to hold on to. Form on the other end a ball, kind of creating a mushroom, and then bend that mushroom to one side over your fingers. Next, use a pointy tool to create the fingers. Work with it until you're happy with the shape that you want. Repeat for the second paw. There we have two ears and two paws. Now time to make the feet. Again, separating two equal parts. First, molding a stem to hold again, leaving a ball on top. Now holding the stem, flatten the ball and shaping it into an oval shape. Using the same pointy tool, create your toe patterns.
and repeat for the second foot. making sure they look somewhat similar. Next, we're making the nose. Pinching a stem to hold on to. Work with your clay forming a bump for the nose. Now to make the eye, again equal parts. Just forming them into a round ball with a stem to hold on to. Now I'll show you in the next video why making the stem is a little bit more important just than holding on to. Making the second eye. Making sure your eyes are around the same size because you don't want to have one big eye and one small eye. And congratulations, you just made your hedgehog body parts. No time to leave them dry. I went ahead and made a few more hedgehogs and body parts. Check out my next video on painting and assembling these hedgehog body parts. So on a couple of my other pieces I made the nose more pronounced and I also put a mouth design on a few of them. So thanks for watching and make sure to check out part 3 on how to paint the hedgehog body parts and assembly. Hit the subscribe button for all new videos.